Hey everybody! Guess who's back with weekly vlogs? So I'm a Georgia girl now. I'm an A-town girl. It's right, A-town, like this. Cam's next to me editing. Say hey, baby cakes. Oh. Ooh, you look a little scary. Anyways, hey guys. Today's Monday. We're starting the video super late today. Usually, like during weekly vlogs, I like to start like in the morning and just vlog my whole day. It's currently 1 p.m. But I haven't been doing anything today. I had like stuff to do around the house. Well, stuff to do around the house, including laundry. Also showering. <laughs> showering. I just did my everything shower. Washed my hair, did a hair mask. I also shaved my legs. Your girl is silky smooth. Um, there's nothing going on today except I do have a rookie practice today. It's not until 7.30 though, so that's why I also didn't want to start the vlog too early because we would have been like sitting here like this. So like, what are you doing today? You know, it just would have been weird. I'm not feeling it. Hold on, one sec. I'm doing business. To walk in. Sorry guys, I'm texting one of the dance studios that I teach at. I'm a working girl now. Ew, why do I sound like that? That's it. Ah, ah, ah. Is this one? I had the mic. Guys, Cam's been doing mic'd up videos. Go follow my bae. I'm gonna put it on the screen. I'll put both his TikToks and his Instagram. We've been doing mic'd up videos while he plays basketball and they've been doing pretty well. So that's what he's editing on. Your girl taught him how to edit because I was tired of editing everything myself. <laughs> All right, um, I don't even know what to say. You know what I can do? I can give you guys a little tour. I'll give you guys a tour. Actually, let me do my hair stuff really quick first. My hair is literally soaking wet and I have to spray it for. Hair routine time. First thing, I'm gonna put in this, not your mother's curl talk, leave-in conditioner. I spray it right into my hands. OGX Curl Perfecting Defining Cream. <clears throat> Big love. <clears throat> My favorite mousse I've ever bought. I don't know if it's Miel or like Miel. <laughs> it's not Miel. Do you think this is Miel? I can never pronounce the name of this brand. I think it's Miel. Can you look it up? We are looking at how to pronounce the name of this brand. The correct pronunciation. Is actually yes. Maya. 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 I like to get fun with this mousse, y'all. Now there's one more step. Gel. I actually let it sit like this for a little bit because I like the gel to get hard and stuff, and then we go in like with the diffuser. But I'll do that later. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. <laughs> it's tour time. I'm not gonna give a tour of the house like in depth because a lot of the stuff is my uncle's and my g-paws because like i said in the last video um me and cam are staying with my uncle and my grandfather so i'm not gonna go crazy i'm really just gonna give you guys a tour of like our room this is the little kitchen area i will be in here a couple of times you know to see me cook and whatnot and this is like the little dining room we usually eat here so it's not like a full on like dining and this is like the living room um, we will be in here a lot too because I use this space for TV dance covers, which I recently posted one. It was the Victoria Monet music video one. Downstairs is how you get into the house. I mean, everything down there is like my grandfather, so I'm not really going to go crazy with that. And then there's this room. So before we moved in, they were using this room as like a storage room. Um, there was just like boxes and stuff. I took over the room. <laughs> so now it's like my dance room filming room like content room i guess um this stuff is my uncle's that's actually mine but my guitar um i got this rolling rack from ikea oh my god i've always wanted one of these but these two shows is all my nail stuff because i do my own nails at home if you guys didn't know but nail stuff and then this is like my wax pots um and waxing stuff which i actually need to plug my wax pot in and then these are my ikea drawers basically like makeup skincare hair care in here and then of course this is the mom desk, I think. I don't even know. But anyways, makeup, my mirror, chair. This is actually me and Cam's stand-up mirror that was in our room, but I brought it in here because obviously if I'm using it as a dance room, then I need a mirror. So I just have it standing right here, my ring light. And then 
my my dance bag. This is our bathroom. I like just took a shower, so the shower curtain's wet, but. And then last, this is the bedroom. It's just a tad bit messy. You walk in, on the back of the door, we have our shoes. Um, all of like the furniture and stuff we got from Ikea. My Jeep helped us and stuff, which love him, but this is our dresser, Ikea mom dresser. Oh my God, ew, I'm like literally exposing me and camera now. We have our TV up on the wall. G-Pod just put this fan up, actually. There wasn't a fan in this room, and he bought a fan because I have to be cold to sleep in general. And then our closet. He also said that he was going to put more racks and stuff in the closet. So it's a little bit full because I have a lot of clothes. And then, of course, this is our bed. I can't exactly remember the name of the bed frame, but it's really cool. This um, headboard, which you put stuff on top, and it's also bookshelves on the side. And then the bed frame I really like because it has drawers. This is, um, of course, another messy drawer. I'm just exposing myself. Um, it has two drawers on each side. So he has some clothes on his side. And then I have sweatpants and like going out tops in there. And then this is like my electronic drawer and there's bags and stuff as well. On each side of like the bed, we have these floating shelves, which we actually didn't get these at first, but we don't have nightstands. And that is because like our headboard kind of serves as our nightstand. And also we have like drawers or so if we got a nightstand, we wouldn't really be able to open the drawers. So I was like, oh, why don't we get these like floating shelves? I ended up using it as like a shoe display, as you can see. So this is my side. I have all of like my best shoes, my best looking shoes in here. Yeah, and then I also want to show you guys this too. This little lamp. We also got this from Ikea. It literally clips onto your bedside table and you just turn it on. It's basically, oh my God, it's so bright. It's basically like a reading light. So if I'm ever like in here doing stuff and it's like nighttime, I can just turn my little lamp on. And yeah, and then this is our bed. It's obviously not made. I mean, the pillows are made, but we just didn't put the blankets up. But basically the only thing that we really have to do is a curtain. My hair looks so stringy and stuff during this process of my hair. I'm gonna go make a snack. I don't know what I'm gonna make yet. It's not gonna be very entertaining. So whenever I start getting ready and stuff, I'll check back in with y'all. Hi friends. Hi everybody, it's a couple of hours later. It's five o'clock, 5.14. After the last time you saw me, literally I did exactly what I told you. I made food and I've literally just been chilling since. Um, I let my hair just completely air dry. I didn't even put a diffuser to it and it doesn't look bad. It looks just a little flat because I was laying down. I'm gonna take just a little bit of um, oil. I like to put oil in my hair um, to help with the crunch because with the amount of mousse and stuff I put in my hair, sometimes it'd be crunching. The back is... It's, my hair is a little confusing, but it's fine. I have a little bit of a hard time filming while I get ready and like do my makeup and stuff because I be getting so focused. I be forgetting that the camera's on. Usually I like to do a full face of makeup, but I'm gonna keep it super light today. I'm gonna just do, instead of doing like foundation, I'm just gonna do like concealer. I really wanna go get a facial. I literally haven't gotten a facial y'all since esthetician school, which for those of you that have asked in my comments and stuff, I am still an esthetician. I actually do have my license in Georgia now. I just think with what's going on in my career right now, aesthetics is just not in the cards. I'm still gonna keep my license active and stuff because it's always a just in case. Also, I kind of, I changed my mind a lot. <laughs> Not necessarily change my mind, I just get indecisive. I also did find like a gig job for like go-go dancers, which is something that I was really interested in before I moved here. Moving on, we're gonna do the face. Obviously my hair, but we're gonna go ahead and pick my fit. Um, I do have to wear Hawks colors. I think yoga pants are gonna, are gonna be the move. Oh, these are so comfy cozy. I think I got these from TJ Maxx. Maybe I'll wear this top. I got this top from Windsor. I actually wore it for the showcase for the audition. I think I'll wear this because I haven't worn it and I kind of forgot about it. Dirty. 
um, it's fine. Okay, we in the kitchen real quick. Before we go to practice, I'm gonna make a quick snack. We are going to have chicken apple sausage with cottage cheese. Okay, if you are from TikTok, then you've probably heard of it, but there's a lady named Tiffany, and she makes these things called Tiffany plates. She basically puts cottage cheese, mustard, and then she'll put, she gets chicken apple sausages, she puts like asparagus, um, she eats like hearts of palm. She basically just puts a bunch of vegetables and eats it. And it's like a trend that people like try it. Um, I tried it the other day and it's actually pretty good, but I will say that the chicken apple sausage with cottage cheese is now my new favorite snack. Look it on there. Cheers. Mm hmm. It's so good. breakfast as you saw both everything bagel this just has butter and jelly and then this is avocado and a sunny side up egg what's on the agenda today i have two classes today jazz and hip-hop tonight at excel studios i'm planning to do a tv dance cover like maybe like friday to the new jungle what is it i don't even know back on 74 Anyways, I want to do a TV dance cover to that, so I need to see if I can put together an outfit. I like to match the outfit as much as possible. We might have to go to Goodwill today for that. Cam is going to Augusta tonight, so Cam's not going to be here for the next couple days. He'll be back on Friday, though. Mm. You know what I need? Orange juice. I'm gonna finish eating, um, get myself together because I look crazy. I need to wash my face still, do my hair because obviously I slept with a bonnet. So, whenever I get ready and we're about to go do things, I will hit y'all up. later 209 to be exact we're going to goodwill i'm gonna try to find this and i want to recreate this outfit right here the girl in the middle um i have like a red tank top but i'm still gonna see if i can find something because this is like a vest that she has on so really i need like the vest i need some pants like that and then a scarf because i want to do this like whole beginning section with her and then possibly do the popular one the guy you guys know if you've been on TikTok, this guy right here. The main thing I need is the pants and the scarf, but if I can find a top, then that will work. Yeah, there's one that's 2.6 miles away. Eight minutes. I posted this cute little like, come with me to class reel, and it was like at Excel Studios, and guess who reposted it? Excel talent. Ah! This is the second video that they've reposted on their Instagram of mine. Go under this video on my Instagram and tag Victoria Monet and Bankhead. Sean, I said Bankhead. I literally call him Bankhead, but his name is Sean. <laughs> All right, I just walked in the Goodwill. It is huge in here. I got them having boots. Wait, that pink mob kind of eats though. This music's gonna get me copyrighted. Hi, 
we just left the second Goodwill. We're actually on the way to Chick-fil-A right now because I'm a little hungry. Decided I was gonna give you guys a haul in the car. So at the first Goodwill, I didn't find anything for the costume that I wanted. Like, you know, the whole point of me going to Goodwill. But I did find these North Face pants. Um, literally only $6.24, but they're just like these brownish, greenish pants. Um, and they have a drawstring too. I was a little worried that they won't fit, but Goodwill, um, dressing rooms literally will never open again, I feel like. And then the second Goodwill was definitely a lot better. So first thing was this bandana, which I needed like a scarf to go around my neck for the video. So we have this. I got this like camo tank top because I wanted to crop it just for me. So I'm gonna act like that wasn't in there. And then I did find this red tank top. I already have a tank top at home that I could use, but just in case I have this one that I can like cut like kind of like up and in and kind of make it look like the best like that she wears and then i got two pairs of pants because if one doesn't work then like i have a backup i found these pants but they're a size seven um i did i always do this trick though they might be a little bit big but we're gonna make it work they're just like cream color wide leg they go all the way down super long then i found these pants they're like the magic pants, you know, from like middle school, but they're actually Pretty Little Thing brand, which I love Pretty Little Thing. So if these don't work, then I have these. And I'm probably gonna keep these too because they're cute. We made it back home and I just ate all my food. First class is at seven, but I'm probably gonna leave at six-ish because um, Excel is about like 20-ish minutes away. If there's traffic, it's usually like 30. So, and leaving at around six o'clock, there's probably gonna be just a little bit of traffic. I have about an hour and a half to get ready. I'm super excited for class today. So we're gonna go ahead and pick my fit out. So I told you guys I'm taking jazz and hip hop. So I have to make sure that my um, my outfit is cute enough for jazz, but then it's like uh, enough for hip hop. Does that make sense? I kind of laid like some things out that I thought maybe I could that I could like work with. I think I'm for sure gonna wear this top. Um, it's white and then it has rhinestones as it says high maintenance. It's not really a trend, but I've been seeing like dancers will wear like bathing suit tops to dance and I just think it's so cute like for class and stuff. So I'm thinking about wearing like a bathing suit top or something. This bathing suit out, it's like black and white striped and then it has, oh my God, it's all messed up. And then it has like silver. And then like for pants, I have these really cute like Nike shorts. I actually found these at a Goodwill. I think they are like biking shorts. They definitely are kids though because it says medium but eight to ten in parentheses which I didn't realize. They do fit but they just squeeze my thighs like real tight. But they're super cute. They have like a pocket in the back and then the crotch. I know this is kind of weird to show but to show like the type of shorts they are I think they're biking shorts. They're super cute. So I kind of want to wear these. I'm going to try everything on just to see what goes with what and then after we'll start the face because i'm trying to look cute because they're going to be filming a class today <laughs> so i gotta make sure i'm on my shit tonight i actually already learned the jazz dance that we're doing in class today and i really just want to retake the class because of the camera because i'm trying to get more um like videos dance videos and stuff done and since now i'm in a place where i could get professional videos i'm like yes I actually did just get a professional video of a heels class I took. Look at the quality though. There I am right here. I don't know. I messed up like a good like two times and then my improv wasn't the best. I really need to practice improving and stuff. So I don't know if I'm going to post it, but I did just want the video because I could put it in a reel because I need to make a dance reel too. Here's... The bathing suit top with the shorts, it's really cute. I will say I'm just a little bit nervous because I've never danced in a bathing suit top. <laughs> and then this was like the tank top I was gonna wear on top. And then even if like my bathing suit, like if I get uncomfortable, I could do this. I was kind of thinking of like wearing it up. Okay, I think this is the fit. Period. Love you. Guys, Kim's leaving forever. We're literally going until Friday. It's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. 3,000 days. I'm going Friday. 3,000 days. Love you. We're in the room. First, I'm going to do my hair, and then we're going to do the face.
actual camera with me because I can bring it and I can film in class, but it's just it's just big and extra, so I'll just record on my phone and stuff. This is the finished look. Cute, and I'll probably be up like this though, just to show off the the bathing suit. Wow. It's also cute down there too. All right, I'll see you guys at Excel. Hey, phone cam. Oh my god, I hate vlogging on my phone because it be bringing out all the impurities. Look at all these bumps on my face. Anyways, I finally found a fucking park parking spot. Oh my goodness. When I tell you guys there's no parking spots, I literally need to park. It's like, oh, not across the street, but it's like next door, like all the way down there. And it's about to rain. So I'm trying to walk in here before it starts raining. Frame vlogs. <laughs> Oh my god, there's something literally in my eye right now. We are, we in the studio. They just finished auditions and shit. I think she literally only picked three dancers, which is crazy, but... Yay. Hi vlog. I just got done with Danny's class, about to start hip-hop. Oh, yeah. This is on my YouTube channel. Miss Danny. Hi. <laughs> Anyways, we about to take hip-hop. I love how like halfway through you're like, oh yeah, it's Danny's class. But no, literally, I was like, by the way, let me, I should have said that first. Oh yeah, this has got me lit. Good morning. It is now Wednesday, August 30th. It's 11 o'clock. I pretty much just got out of bed. Like I just washed my face and brushed my teeth. I've been in bed all morning, but your girl went to sleep so late. Um, I barely really vlogged at Excel, which I'm kind of irritated about. Sometimes I like to like set up my phone in class and just like record me taking the class. But there was like a lot of people in both of the classes, especially the jazz class. There was a lot of people in there, whatever. But I vlog like in between classes. Classes were a lot of fun. It was also my first time taking Chris Harris's class. I keep wanting to call him Chris Lucky because I think Chris Lucky is his Instagram. Anyways, like I said, I just got out of bed, but I did want to update you. I had mentioned something about like go-go dancing gigs. Um, I like did like a little audition the other day. So I had to send her like videos of me improving and stuff. And now I can literally work as like a go-to dancer with this lady at least. And she literally texted me in the group chat and it said prepare to work Saturday. So, and um, she asked if I could work Thursday too. So I said yes. So tomorrow I teach until 9 p.m. And then right from the studio I teach at, I'm just driving straight there because it's about 35 minutes. Given that I do have to go get things for this job. So she has a post on her thing. It says, go, go bag necessities. So I have to, these are the things I have to get. Skin tone fishnets. She said also skin tone tights too, if you want more coverage. I'll probably just stick with the fishnet. Black flat combat boots and then hair. I have to get a 24 inch ponytail. It says one wavy, one straight, but I'm just gonna get straight for right now. And then it says like little things to have in the bag, hair elastics, bobby pins, um, gel, hair cream, brush comb, wig cap, wig clips. And then safety pins, double stick tape, pasties. It's like perfect because I actually just got paid from choreography that I had to do for something back home. I'm gonna make some cereal and probably just edit for a little bit. Oh, also, I literally ripped all my nails off last night. One of them fell off during jazz class. As I was walking to the car, I just took that one off and then driving home, I was just... I was just ripping all of them off. So my nails look crazy talk right now. All right, I'm gonna go eat some breakfast. Oh, not the free feed, stop. I'll see you guys later. Hi vlog, look at my hair. I did not do my hair. I literally just took it out of the bonnet and said, whatever. I'm in the car right now. I don't have like a stand. I'm in my G-Paws car right now and I don't have a stand. So I literally have to, my phone is in the cup holder, but we're going to Target. I decided I'm just gonna go ahead and try to get all my things today. So we're gonna go to Target and then to a hair store. There we go. Starting minutes. route to 875 Lawrenceville Swanee Road. Oh. I did not slow down over that speed bump. The lighting looks so bad right now. Anyways, we're on the way to Target. At Target, I'm gonna get tights, um, fishnets. I kinda need a new concealer, so I'll probably get a new concealer. There's a mall like right next to the house, so I can go run in there. I think there's a Charlotte Russe in there, which y'all know, Charlotte Russe has the best shoes. <laughs> Look at these pants. Hey, body suit. Wait, this is cute though. Bro, they don't have fishnets at Target. Oh, they have these fishnets. They have black ones, but I need like tan ones. You know what I am about to get though? 
some Starbucks. You can't go to Target and not get Starbucks. So I'm gonna go grab Starbucks and then we're gonna go to a Walmart or something because, yeah. And I have to go to a, I need to find a good um, hair supply store so I can find some hair. What time is it before they start yelling at me? I literally always get this drink, strawberries and cream frappuccino. It's so good. I will say they put a little bit too much strawberry. I usually like it to be a little bit more cream rather than the strawberry. And then I also got a butter croissant and a birthday cake cake pop. Slaps every time. Especially my roots and this is black but whatever i guess the other spot i got this which this will definitely i think this would match my hair more and it just has like sprinkles of red in it pretty but it's a wrap ponytail so you wrap this around and then you take this piece of hair and then you wrap it around like that this one would is i think this one will definitely match more than the other one yeah, for sure. But I just got that one because it's an actual drawstring one, and I don't know how well this one will work. It's super thick, though. Also got an edge brush, which this is so cute. From Forever 21, um, I didn't record it, but I actually went in there and I grabbed some underwear because I needed some nude thongs. So I got three pairs of nude thongs, and then I got a black one, and then a pair of blue shorts. And then last but not least, Charlie Roos. I got shoes, so I got this cute little off-brand Uggs. So cute. And then the last pair. Are these combat boots? I got these for work, but I'm definitely gonna wear these for anything because they're literally so cute and they're so comfortable. I managed to get everything I needed today, which I didn't think I was gonna be able to. It's 3.14 right now. I'm probably gonna leave in like 30 minutes-ish. Hi friends, I'm at the studio as you can see. This is the studio I'm in today. There's tapping upstairs, that's why it's so loud, but I was in that studio up there. Class is literally about to start, so I'm gonna go ahead and open this door. There's a lot of kids in this class. Hi, friends. Good, like 11 or 12 kids in this class, and then we're gonna start. Okay, y'all, I just got done with tap, now it's ballet. Look at how many kids in this class. I'm eating a snack because I'm so hungry. But two more classes. I gotta play my princess ballet music. That's the best way to go. That's ballet class music if you're teaching little babies. class so this will be fine it's an hour long I do a lot better teaching adults anyways <laughs> I love this 
Do you guys know I like to do my choreographic meets and I want to ask because they, I think there's probably like, if I'm not mistaken, I think there's like four studios in here. There could be more. So I want to ask if like, if she doesn't have classes throughout the day, if I can like come in and use the studio. I'm vlogging. What are you talking about? I'm just doing my weekly vlog. Oh uh, yeah. This is my Uncle Vincent, guys. All right, y'all, I'm home. I am craving hibachi so bad right now, but it's freaking pouring down rain. Also, everything is pretty much closing. So I'm gonna make tacos. It's good on a taco. Right, y'all. I just got done making my tacos. We're just gonna sit and chat a little bit while I eat. We're about to do a little mukbang. My classes were super good today. That little ballet class though. There's so many kids in there. Oh my God. Okay, I just changed the lighting because I looked so yellow. Okay, my camera's about to die. So let's take a bite of this taco really quick together. Mmm. This is really good. Hello everybody, good morning. It is now Thursday. I'm literally pretty much up and out of bed. Um, I got up, ate breakfast. I actually just got out of the shower and I'm about to do some laundry really quick. I also need to wax my armpits, so we'll do that together. And then I teach classes tonight, five to nine. And then straight after that, I'm going to my first gig as a go-go dancer tonight. I'm super excited about that. I'm actually gonna do my full face of makeup for tonight um, before I leave to go teach classes. So I'm gonna be teaching classes with pretty much full face of makeup on. So yeah, so after the dance studio, I'll actually probably go and get food or something, just something quick, probably McDonald's, honestly. <laughs> But I'll probably go grab food on the way and then eat and then by that time Hopefully it'll be time to go in I don't know if I'm gonna bring my camera into that club with me just because I've never been there before and I don't know what's gonna happen So I'm probably gonna leave my camera in the car, but I will be sure to vlog as much as I can on my phone <laughs> some things went to the same beauty supply store that i went to yesterday and i got um wig caps this comes in a pack of two so and then i actually had to go to kroger because i had to get my g-possum pico because he was so adamant about me getting him pico for his tacos that he makes at home so i actually got some sushi from kroger y'all kroger sushi is literally my favorite thing i'm gonna eat and then we're gonna wax my armpits. I have my wax pot here. I actually turned it on probably like two days ago. Um, and I'm gonna use hard wax. I'm actually gonna turn this side off. I was telling you guys about this rolling rack a couple days ago. This is literally my favorite thing. Um, because anytime I'm doing my nails or I'm waxing, I just roll it over right next to me, pull straight from the cart, and then I just push it back where it goes. This is just a crunchy California roll. I usually like to get like whatever spicy roll they have, but I didn't see a lot. Oh my god, look at all this. Let's try it together. Mm -hmm. I just finished eating my sushi. That shit was gas. But we're about to wax my armpits now. I ugh, I always get so nervous when it comes to waxing. We are going to prep. So I'm using Tress Wellness. I've worked with them before. <clears throat> this is actually Tress Wellness Wax. I just put it in the Satin Smooth Wax Pot because I like the wax pot. I have some of these... Bikini Star Hard Wax Beads. This is like the cleansing spray. And then just wipe. Oh, I always get nervous to like put it on me at first. And we press. Nice application. It's definitely difficult to wax yourself just because of like the way you have to like hold your hand. All right. Let me get a good grip on it. Okay, going up is, oh, this wax is a little too warm. It's okay. Oh gosh, see, it's a struggle. 
Oh my god, it's like good as new. Period. Hello everybody. It is a little bit later as you can see. I have makeup on. The eyebrows are looking a little cuckoo, honestly. Um, so yeah, I pretty much did like a full face of makeup. I didn't go crazy with the eye makeup because since I'll probably have a little bit of time to like touch up my makeup um, during the go-go job later, then I'm just gonna like throw on some like darker brown and probably like a wing or like make this little liner black and then I'm gonna put um, like black eyeliner on my waterline and then throw on my new lashes. And I just wanted to show you my fit really quick. I have just this white tank top on and then a black cardigan. And then these are actually the pants that I got from Goodwill yesterday. No, two days ago, the North Face pants. Um, I was worried about them not fitting, but the drawstring, like they fit perfect. Hold on, I'm gonna show you guys better. Okay, this is like a better angle of them, but they're literally so cute. Um, they're pretty much, they're like pretty much a perfect length. Um, and yeah, they fit really nice. And they're gonna be so fun to dance in. I love the color. I'm here. This is the studio that I will be in today. Um, it's basically the same as yesterday, but it is wood floor instead of marble floor. Whenever I open my own dance studio, it's literally gonna be like this. Like I want floors, I want multiple dance rooms. And I just want everything to be nice and organized. Glacier freeze. The best way though. It's so good. Gatorade hits. Me and my boyfriend were having a debate. He thinks body armor drinks are better. I don't know. Gatorade's my favorite, but looking at my roster, the classes we teach today are tap three. There's really only three girls in the class. Ballet one, that is one, two, three, four five girls in the class it could possibly be six but last the last two weeks two the girl didn't show up anyways then we have jazz one which is one two three four five six girls the last class of the night is adult ballet which is one two three four five six seven girls on the roster but last week i only had four girls come so as they kind of come in i just make sure i get their names and stuff i'm super excited i'm also obsessed with these pants Hi guys, um, I just got done with classes. It is currently 9.14 and I am heading out. Um, I'm actually gonna stop by McDonald's. <sighs> oh, my guilty pleasure. But there's one like super close, so I'm gonna stop by McDonald's just so I can grab something to eat. And then we're just gonna head straight there. It is a 30 minute drive to where I'm going, but by the time I get there, it should be good. But I'm super excited. <laughs> I'm about to be dancing. Hi. Oh my God, my eyebrows look hella dark. I hate that. Anyways, I just got to the place. Um, I think we're usually supposed to park like across the street. I'm supposed to sit here and wait for the like the lady that like hired me. And then we're supposed to walk in together. But the guy like literally just let me park back here. So I just have to kind of sit here and wait. I really have to pee. But I literally already ate my McDonald's. And G-Pod for watching this. I'm sorry, but I had to eat in your car. But I literally just got like this huge cheeseburger meal and a Dr. Pepper. I'm super excited though because it's supposed to be like a Latin night. So gonna be like latin music reggaeton um like bachata and salsa and stuff so i'm super excited i hope that i can put this wig on because i'm gonna look so embarrassed if this wig looks stupid or if it falls off my head while i'm dancing i promise you i will literally just leave 
I will be so embarrassed. I've never put a wig on, so we're gonna see how this works. All right, y'all. I'm in the little dressing room. It's like just a small bathroom. It has clothing up, but this is the costumes and stuff that we're wearing. So I'm actually about to try and see what it looks like. So we're wearing one pieces. I'm gonna show you on. A sparkly bra. Cute. Stop. Flame sunglasses. And then <laughs> I think this is the wig. Stop. We're wearing red wigs. I want to see what this looks like. Stop. It's like a short wig. Oh my god, stop. I'm gonna try to put on an outfit. <laughs> Give me a second. Oh my god. Okay, so this is a fit. I have my fishnets on. They are a little big, but it's fine. And then we're wearing this cute, like, colorful bodysuit. We're actually wearing it backwards with this sparkly bra under it. It looks so cute. It's kind of a little bit thongy in the back, but, um,. Oh shit, what's going on here? Oh. So then we wear gloves and then this, I guess this necklace is fucking thick. These fire ass flame glasses. I'm so excited. Okay, how does this go? This goes back. Mm -hmm. Like under here? Mm -hmm. Okay. What is this? No. Anything. <laughs> Dude, I'm dead right now. I'm just giggling because I've literally never had a wig on my face. I mean, on before. <laughs> I feel like that video, like with Nicki Minaj, and she's like, "That's very accurate." What's your name? B.O.B. I like calling you Bob. nobody in here like the bang sticking to my forehead is crazy so we're just back here for 15 minutes and then we just dance for like 30 minutes at a time which is fine i just wish that there was a lot more people but it's fine and it's literally all bachata like there's literally not even salsa i'm like hello well i mean the last song is yeah. salsa but i'm like yeah this is not it's just not i know you said like not right like you don't really like reggaeton but like i wish they kind of this no, that's what I'm saying. I'd rather have that than just strictly like bachata and like slow salsa because it's a little slow and we're both like just doing the same thing like 